Hey everybody, it's Tim. Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, uh, I am an author of uh, primarily science fiction and fantasy. I am the author of the Dragon and the White series, uh, the science fiction novella Eggs and Two Baskets, and the soon-to-be-released uh, children's book that's based on Mars. Um, more information will come in the note about that soon. Uh, today I want to do another book review. I'm actually going to do uh, two books because uh, it's basically a, a series at this point. I know I'm a little late to the game, so I'm not going to go in heavy detail on the book's content, uh, just kind of more of my personal feelings of it. So if this is a little bit rambling, uh, it's not really scripted. This is kind of me talking. So today I'm going to be talking about, as you saw on the title screen, uh, Hank Green's first and second book, um, uh, An Absolutely Remarkable Thing, and then the sequel, A Beautifully Foolish Endeavor. So the first one came out last year and the second came out earlier this year during the pandemic. If you're watching this later, this is uh, the beginning of 2021. And they're just amazing books. Uh, I really liked them. They blend some elements of other movies and books that I really, really enjoy. Um, it's part Matrix. It's part, um, you know, not teen angst because uh, everybody in the book is early 20s. Um, but there's a element of Ready Player One in there and basically it focuses around a young woman, April May, and she ends up finding herself sort of tossed into this instant celebrity status where she has sort of information, not really privy, but she got to it first and because of her online presence, uh, she was sort of catapulted into the spotlight and it's talking about the statues that she discovers, the Carls, she thinks there's just one, there ends up being many, many around the world. And as you find during the reading of the book, the Carls are there for a higher purpose and they are there to, you know, I don't want to spoil too much, but it's basically bringing together people in the sense that they should be brought together. And the, the first book takes you through really the elements that lead up to it. And the second book brings you through sort of the resolution of the story and where things needed to go to bring everything that happened in the first book kind of back down to ground earth and bring it back to you know point zero so um yeah if you haven't read it yet um i highly recommend you go out and grab an absolutely remarkable thing uh, it's a really great story it's gonna kind of pull at your heartstrings at times it's going to excite you from a scientific standpoint there's uh, some new elements in there that really kind of make you think and if you like anything that has to do with um, sort of, you know, maybe artificial intelligence, um, augmented reality, and just kind of seeing our current world from a slightly different perspective, I think you'll enjoy this story. Um, if you have any ideas on this, you know, hit the comments down below and we can talk about it. And um, let me know what you think about the books, uh, if you've read one or both. And um, if you haven't, uh, if you have any other questions, I highly recommend you check out, uh, you know, Hank Green's website. Um, if you haven't followed them yet, follow the Blonde Brothers, um, him and John Green, um, who you most likely know from John Green's books. Um, they're excellent content creators and always have fun stuff going up on the internet, um, especially if you love just watching their asynchronous conversations going back and forth in their videos every week. So um, yeah, I hope you enjoy the book. Uh, check them both out and uh, you know, let me know what you think. Um, if you like this kind of content, uh, check out the links over here. I'm going to put up some other materials. I've done a bunch of reviews at this point and more just going to keep coming out. And then obviously you can follow me for more information on my own books. Uh, like I said, The Dragon and the Whites, um, followed by Washington's Dragon Hunter, Dragon Liberator, and then the novella Eggs and Two Baskets, and my soon-to-be-released uh, first children's book, which I can't wait to tell you about. So I hope you have a great day. Uh, check out these other videos, and I look forward to talking to you soon. All right, thanks. Bye.